Now we've been taking a little heat lately on a completely unfair mischaracterization that we've been providing cover for the Biden administration's actual crimes while persecuting his political opponent, Donald J. Trump. But that's not what we're doing, swear to God. Some people recall how on the same day the Oversight Committee accessed suspicious activity reports on potential corruption within the Biden crime family, Soros-backed District Attorney Elvin Bragg indicted Trump. And that's not a tactic of weaponization. It's really a shame, actually, because having to investigate Trump for what we said he did diverted our resources from investigating Biden for what he actually did. And you know, all of us at the Bureau were remorseful, to say the least.